Greetings everybody out there in the watch loving world. Today we're going to talk about my 1963 Hamilton J18 Rodney. And it's an Inland Steel 25 year award watch. But first, the time is 9.46 on the money. And I'm wearing the Seiko SKX 173. My first watch, my diver the tank. Okay, we're going to talk about the 1963 J18 Rodney. It's 10 carat gold filled. It's a Hamilton made in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. And it's kind of a piece of American history. Uh, you can see the, the dial is really nice. It's got the little gold indices, Arabic numerals. And you probably can't see it, but around the dial is the minute markers from 1 to 60 so that's a uh, pretty nice it's um, 34 millimeter and the wingspan is 44 millimeters it's got a bubble back and it actually has the guy's name well you can't see it but it's inland steel Charles W Lehman 25 year club engraved in the back of it this is the Hamilton caliber 748 manual winding caliber. It has 18 joules. It beats at 21,600 beats per hour. And um, I picked it up. Actually, I worked at Inland Steel from 1976 to 1988. And I thought, well, in 2001 would have been my 25 years. So I would have got my watch in 2001. But the economy and things being like they were, I never made it. But anyway, I still got my 25-year watch. Got it on eBay. Um, so it's a nice little watch made in 1963. Uh, it runs actually good. You have to wind it every day. And um, it's, it's a nice watch. Um, in 1963, I found the Hamilton catalog for the Rodney, which is over here. And the list price on this in 1963 was 85 dollars so you multiply that by 8.26 and in 2019 dollars this would be 702 dollars and 10 cents the equivalent i remember when i was a kid you know 15 cents would buy a candy bar or a pop so an 85 dollar watch was a lot of money in 1963 I mean, you can buy a 63 Chevy car for twenty two ninety five, And people were making a couple bucks an hour there, $4,000 a year. four to 5000 a year was good money. So, this is kind of a piece of American history. A Hamilton made in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. It's a very quality watch. And for the age of it, it's, it's the uh, crystal is not scratched. Somebody's taking real good care of it. Well, it's an award watch. So around a few years later, at 30 years, the guy probably retired. And this was his dress watch. It was a very sought after, very prized possession of Charles Lehman. And so I'm kind of glad I got it now. It's a prized possession of mine. I don't wear it too much. Um, but it keeps good time. It's um, You wind it every day. And I can wear it. It's a very nice watch, a quality watch. An American-made Hamilton from Lancaster, Pennsylvania from 1963. And 34 millimeter, actually, I have an eight and a half inch wrist. But you know what? 34 millimeters still looks good on that wrist. In the old days, this is what people wore. <laughs> and um, it looks good. Okay, I got a large wrist. And it's a small watch, but I can still see it. It's a nice watch. Um, if you can get a hold of one of these old Hamiltons, um, they're quality. They're really nice. 34 millimeter, not bad. I kind of like it. So, if you like this video, hit like, hit subscribe. And I'll be making a video from time to time. Uh, I really love watches. 
And this is one of my prized possessions, everybody. And so remember, in the end, to keep your watches all wound up. Thank you.